Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to try and upload uh, an audio file using uh, Python. So let me start by importing my operating system. Uh, let's say from uh, TK Inner import import all and I'm just gonna call that my application equals tk enter my parenthesis and uh, the next thing is let me give this uh, brief tutorial a title I'll just call it uh, um, audio let's call it audio player so that's going to be the title for my um, I think I'm going to just let me get the canvas in here let's say uh, canvas oh, let's say okay copy this uh, let's say F canvas alright equals canvas itself alright then I'll get the background maybe I should just make the background something black or white uh, black for now I can always change it and uh, the height of this my canvas I really don't need this canvas but just in case I'm, I might need it for something else and the width equals let's make that maybe let's see about I can always reduce the I can always reduce it anyway let's say by 800 and that's my canvas for this tutorial the next thing I'm going to do is let me define my method or if you guys want to call it I just call it a uh, function method of function that's my function I want this very function to call the very first sound um, audio file okay so I'll say system uh, operating system dot system you can see it right there okay so the very first audio file I want to call is right here somewhere let me see if I can get it okay it's one of these my my music tunes I don't know what it's called but if I double click on it you guys can hear the sound I guess you can hear that so that is the audio file I intend to use okay I'm just gonna close that well, let's see again I have three three of those in there that's for that's the A tone and I have another one here B and so on. So those are the audio files I intend to I'll be using one, two and three. Can you hear that? Okay, I'm just gonna close it. Alright, this audio file is uh, a wave file. So the address uh, the file will become let's say C which is the directory let me enter my quote C backslash I think that did call it Python yep it's actually Python 30 Python 34 slash work alright 
n slash sam okay now I now have slash a and there it is that's my file right there I didn't get that and that's for the wave file alright so just close that so that's the first function I'm just gonna copy this because I can always alright I have the first one I have to get those indented so let's change this one to two and these three let's change the wave file this one is BB which is right here and you guys see that BB the next one is B so change that to A uh, to B sorry and that will be all so because I want to use a graphical user interface to call these those files I think I'm just going to use a, let me declare a variable and okay I want the following uh, radio button one let's just call that RB RB1 equals radio radio button app this very app that is the name okay I want a text there the text will be let's just call that play play audio audio one and that's the name Okay, then put a comma in there and let the variable equals by comma the value in this case that's where I want it equals one and the command will be command equals sound sound one. I just increase this so that you guys see that okay close that now we just I might as well just copy this and change one or two things as one two and three two and three and you over here one two and three two three okay so let me my rb1 dot pack let it anchor to anchor it to the west or maybe east I don't know let's just give it west for now I can always change it and close that and the same thing we apply to the other two radio methods good Let's close that F canvas dot pack and app itself dot main loop. Okay, now let's change this to three and two. All right, hopefully it's the program is ready now so I'm just gonna save it and run it file save us save audio audio sound it was time for the same audio and sound okay as it saved so I'm just gonna now run the program and see how it goes so like I said, let's just run it. 
there guys and this is how you create your own uh, audio rec audio player so if I click on this very first object my audio file is loading and here it comes that's it right there can you guys hear that you hear that so I'm gonna play the next one now click on the next one second audio file and you guys see the file B close that let's try out C as it B B you hear that guys and that's how you create your own f audio file within uh, Python so I'm just going to call it today but before I do that although I'll be creating another tutorial for a video using the same method so let me just close this and show you the codes one more time you guys see the code that's the line of code I actually used I've made some corrections there were some mistakes here so it's corrected now you see that that is the code so have a good look at it you can always improve on that but uh, be careful this is my own location of where my audio files was uh, saved so you can always change this to your own location the canvas and so on is just my own uh, as my own add-on you can even play it without any of these all right so let's uh, run the program one more time and that's it guys let's play an audio tune Okay, that's how you create your own audio player. Thank you.